This is the first day of the rest of my life. Let's do this. this. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. It, this is exactly, we close on this property January, January 16th. And it was the same exact kind of day it is today. And I said, January 16th, I said to my husband, this is our grandpa's looking down on us, wishing us good. And I feel the same exact way right now. Hey guys, Erica with the K here. Today's video is going to be unlike anything I've ever filmed before. Um, so before I begin, I wanna say that I know that there's going to be a lot of hate surrounding this video, not because of anything bad that has happened to me or that I'm doing in my life, but because I've noticed that when good things happen for people, um, oftentimes there's a lot of hate or jealousy or anger that surround that. Um, so I just want to start off by saying I, I know and I understand that this that is what this video is going to bring, but I hope that um, the news that I'm about to share with you that some of you guys could uh, maybe put that aside and just be happy for good things going on in people's lives. So. Um, I also want to start off by saying my exciting news for my business has nothing to do with pregnancy. I am not pregnant. Um, I have put on a little bit of winter weight, but I am not pregnant. Um, and that would never be a business announcement. That would be a personal announcement. And um, that is not what this video is. So if you are waiting for me to be like, I'm pregnant, you're not going to find that here. So um, sorry to disappoint anybody who thinks that that was my exciting business news. It, it is not. It was not. Um, my exciting news, it's hard for me not to get emotional when I talk about this, so I just had like that feeling in my throat like I want to throw up. Never in a million years would I ever think that I would be where I am um, mentally, physically, emotionally, um, monetarily. Like I, I never thought that I would be here. I never thought that this was going to be my life path. I mean, I've dreamt about it. I have a notebook from when I was a kid that was like, I wanna, I wanna have a successful marriage and I wanna have a successful um, career and I want to open up a salon like you know you have dreams but like to actually be sitting here and being like you guys if you guys have been following me you guys have literally been watching my dreams unfold day after day after day after day my exciting news is that my husband and I are commercial property owners and our commercial property is our salon it's so fitting because March is like women's month and like I know that I'm not like you know, the Michelle Pfeiffer of like whatever, or the Stevie Nicks, like I know that like I'm not on that level, um, but that doesn't take away from how far I have come personally in my life. And there are so many people I have to thank for that. And I don't want this to seem like, I think I'm like accepting some like Oscar award or something. This is literally me humbly saying, I could not be here. I could not be making this video without my list of thank yous. And so I wanna start by saying, um, Thank you so much to my to my subscribers, my uh, YouTube subscribers. Thank you for my followers on Instagram. Thank you for my followers on Facebook. You guys have literally helped me get to where I am today by liking my posts and sharing my stuff. And like that is women supporting women. It doesn't have to be, you don't have to come from across the country to get your hair done by me to support my business. You could just like a post. Um, it goes so far. It's social media. It goes so far. You guys could like a video. You guys could share a post. You guys could share a video. And you guys have done that. And I appreciate that so, so, so beyond belief. Like, I, I can never tell you guys. I mean, I started my YouTube channel in 2015. I think I had 300 subscribers. I'm still a very little YouTube channel. But the amount of traction that I have gotten or the amount of success I have gotten from YouTube is unmeasurable. I don't even know how that translates into my hair and makeup business. I don't even know how many of you guys actually see my YouTube videos and think I want to get my hair done by her. I don't know. Um, but I imagine it's, it's a very large amount. And so I thank you guys so, so much. It means so much to me. And I, I could say I wouldn't, I wouldn't be filming a video if, if you guys didn't support my channel the way you did. And if you guys didn't support my Instagram the way you did. And so I appreciate that so much. Um, to my clients, I don't think, I don't think there are words that can explain how thankful I am for each and every one of you. Um, we didn't miss a beat coming. Like um, this is where, this is where I'm going to get emotional. We didn't miss a beat when I said to you guys, "Hey, uh, I'm changing salons," and I didn't know. I have great relationships with so many of you guys, and I didn't know if you guys would follow me. And 99% of you guys were like, "Great, 
Brewster, here we come, like coming with you wherever you go. And today I came into the salon, today was my first day here and you guys came, you get, brought me gifts and I feel so silly right now, but even if you didn't bring me gifts, even if you just came here, like that just means so much to me. I have a completely full book this whole week. I am booked out on Saturdays until May 9th and you guys have been with me through my price raise my price raises um you know you guys you guys are the heart of my business you guys have been liking my posts and sharing my stuff and watching my my instagram live videos and watching my youtube videos and commenting on my stuff and sharing it and you guys you guys have been referring your friends like crazy um i can't even tell you how many new clients i have because of you guys literally because of you guys you guys have built my business i do not advertise i do not pay for advertising i do not pay for instagram facebook newspaper uh, any kind of advertising i do not pay for it so you guys have literally built my business and you guys support me in so much and I get so much, I think the word is solace. I'm not sure if that's the right word, but I get so much from you guys. Um, just being a part of your lives and having you guys be a part of my life is so special to me and I appreciate you guys so much. So obviously there would be no salon without you guys. So um, I appreciate you guys. So thank you so, so much. Um, to Beth, I want to thank you. Uh, the journey between us has been a rocky one to say the least, um, but as I had said in the thank you card for you, she was the lawyer who helped us close, well, who closed, who read through all the papers. She was fighting on fuel prices for me so that I didn't have to pay astronomical prices to you know, pay for the fuel, like just things like that that like I can't do, I don't do, she did for me. But you gotta thank the people who were there for you. Um, and the past is the past and, and the future is the future. And you have been there for me during this whole process as a friend. And thank you so much for everything that you have done. And uh, you know, thank you for fighting for me on, on many different levels during this, um, during this whole thing. Thank you for coming here even after your eye surgery and helping out. You know, my dad coming up here and helping out, I really appreciate it. Um, to Joey, my husband, he literally <laughs> spent every night for the past month and a half here, even on weekends when I was still working at the uh, other salon, he would come here and he would get everything done. Um, he literally has built my dreams with his bare hands in every aspect of our life. We just finished house construction and then he came in and he literally just puts my mind at ease. Anything that I feel like, Joey, I can't do that, or anything, anything, he's like, I'll do it, just make your life easier. I will do it, I will do it. And it's not what he does for me. That's not why I'm thanking him for what he does for me. I'm thanking him for who he is as a person because there is nobody else in the world that I would ever fit with the way I fit with him. He is literally my soulmate and he is just, God, he has just done so much for this place. It's not even, it's not funny. It's literally not funny. He is selfless and he has dedicated so much time to this project and the salon would not be ready in the, in the time frame that I said it was supposed to be ready. And I was like, hey, I gotta get out of that place and this is the time frame. And he's like, all right. And he dedicated countless hours and he has saved us thousands of dollars doing the work himself. And uh, he impresses me every day and he's such a perfectionist and he's just an amazing person and I love him so much. And so Joey, I love you. Thank you so much for everything. Before I give my final thank you, I just wanna say there are so many people that I could thank individually on an individual level. And um, you know, this video would be like 10 hours long, but these are the people who have really just helped in this, in this whole thing, this whole project. Um, it happened so fast. And the person who literally got the wheels in motion and who started this whole thing was my dad. And so thank you to my dad. Um, he literally came to the salon one day and said, you gotta get out of here, it's not safe here. Start looking for a commercial property. And I was like, oh, okay dad, like I can't afford that. Like mine and my husband, all of our money goes into our house. We're trying to pay off our house. I was like, "There's, we can't afford this. We just finished construction. Every day he called me up, do you look for a commercial property? Do you look for a commercial property? I am so lucky to have my dad as a friend through the years somebody I talked to literally every day. When I was raising prices, I would call him and ask him what he thought. When I'm doing something for my clients, I ask him, what do you think? Anytime there's a promotion, I run it by my dad. I'm so lucky to have a mentor 
as my dad, like, and have that be my dad, and then to now be like, hey, my dad is mine and my husband's fucking hero. Like, he set us up for life. He set us up for life. And I know many people are going to be like, you don't deserve it. Mm. But it's like, I worked really fucking hard to be where I am on every social media platform with my clients to book out my book. I have been self-employed for the last eight years. There is not a person in the world handing me a paycheck ever in those last eight years. I did this. I got myself here. My dad recognized it. And he got me to that next level. He got me to the level where I am now. And so I said to my dad, dad, this is an opportunity I would have never had without you. And he's like, no, you would have done it. You would have done it without me. I'm just helping you out. And to have somebody believe in your business and to have like somebody invest in you or invest in your future and invest in your career is just amazing to me. And it's like I said to my dad, like, I'm not the kid who's gonna give you the grandkids to carry on the name, but I can carry on the name with hard work, with passion, with a dedication, with long hours. And that is who my dad is. That is who my grandpa was. Be like, hey, welcome to Fulini's Beauty Bar. Wanted to get a video of me in my salon. <laughs> this is craziness. This is Appreciate crazy. Thank you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for your love and support through all of this, all of the time. You guys are amazing. And um, just because I didn't personally shout your name out doesn't mean that I don't owe you a huge thank you. So thank you everybody who has supported me on my journey. Thank you everybody who has gotten me to the place where I am now. Um, there are so many people I've met along the way who have helped me, big or small, and it never goes unnoticed. And I hope that you guys know that I always, always am thanking you in the back of my mind. There, I don't ever forget where I came from. I don't ever forget traveling to people's houses. I don't ever forget renting a chair. I don't forget any of it. So this is where we are now, guys. So I just wanna kind of zoom out on this bad boy and have you guys see, uh, have you guys see what's going on here. All right, thank you guys. Until next time, work hard, dream big, and eat cake. Bye, guys.